Welcome, this is the first section of our workshop, survey results, online support, and the six benefits. So during the time that we were planning this workshop, we thought it would make sense to create a survey and reach out to the parents that are in our community to ask them about their opinions and their experience with using online support. And there were five questions in the survey. We're going to cover a couple of them because we thought they were very interesting. So the first question was, are you open to using online support services for your child? And almost 80% of people said yes. 20% said no. And of that 20%, 16% told us why. And they were talking about things as simple as connectivity to the internet, to safety, to whether the tutors would be able to replicate that multi-sensory experience that's so absolutely critical for all our kids. And then Eric and I thought about that a lot, and we're gonna talk about that later. We're gonna talk about different ways that you can mitigate those concerns if you're kind of on the fence about whether you want to use online support. Then the next slide, the second question was fascinating as well. The question was, have you used academic support services for your children in the past? Already, we're seeing 20% of people have tried it to some degree, where 80% have not. So there's clearly a lot of opportunity, but there's a bit more uh, experimentation going on out, out there that we really, we really realized. And now what was interesting as well is that every single person who replied yes also talked to us about why and how it worked. A lot of people thought it was so incredibly convenient. A lot of people thought that it was really successful for them because of the quality and the skill of the tutors that were on the other end. One person even mentioned that, uh, they used Khan Academy, which is really not congruent with the kind of people that we work with, but they still said that they found it to be incredibly useful for them. So there was a, a level of experience that, that gave them a lot more comfort with regard to trying and testing and experimenting with the academic support online. Yeah, and I just wanted to say, if, if people don't know what the Khan Academy is, it's a wonderful place where you can get online pre-recorded tutorials, mostly in math. They also have some in history and in science, and they're growing very rapidly. They are heavily funded, and it's a great place if you can't afford anything where you can get free pre-recorded videos that the kids can watch as many times as they want. And one of the things that I love about the Khan Academy is they've really leveled the playing field for SAT tutoring. So you can now get SAT tutoring and AC2 tutoring on the Khan Academy as well. So it's just the KhanAcademy.com. That's pretty incredible. Yeah. So the question is, what are the benefits of online tutoring? First, there's a choice. There's a wide selection of professionals from around the nation. So even if you're in the woods of Vermont, you could actually work with somebody in New York City. Second, we also have flexibility. Sessions can be conducted anywhere at any time. Third, there's privacy. A lot of my parents are really concerned about privacy issues. If they come to an office, then they might bump into people that they know and they would really rather them not know what's going on with their personal life. So when you do an online session, the sessions are conducted in the privacy of your own home. Fourth, cost. Professionals offer a wide range of prices, so you'll have lots to choose from. And finally, there is convenience. First of all, it will save you time because you're not having to travel and your kids aren't having to travel and you're not having to sit in a waiting room. And then also it opens up your schedule to do other things. And that's not only your personal schedule, but for your child as well. Kids are so overtaxed these days and any way that we can save them a little bit of time so that they can have more downtime is really important. Do you have anything to add to that, Michael? No, I just want to reiterate the cost piece because I know that's a major issue for so many parents. And in our research, we found that you can truly, if you do your due diligence, you can truly find affordable care that is of very high quality. 
So it, it, people have to understand if that's a really major hurdle for you, then online tutoring might be the way to go. And we're going to spend a lot of time over the next several minutes talking about choice and that wide selection of professionals and how you find what you personally need so that you can make this thing work for you and your family. That's right. And, and do know that if somebody just has an undergraduate degree, they're going to be charging a lot less than someone with a doctoral degree. You're going to be paying more for people that have more education. Um, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're better. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. So you can make your own personal choice. So join us for the next video, Understanding the Different Professional Titles.